Well, I'm really looking forward to today. Uh, something I've wanted to do for a long time, but when you do it by yourself, yeah, it's not not it's just not as fun. What the plan is today is we're walking down to uh, Klong, and we'll be taking uh, two uh, commuter boats on the on this Klong, two different lines. I, don't know if I will include a map um, in the uh, in the uh, description, and. It's going to be a bit of a long, long haul on the uh, on the boats. Won't film the entire thing because I'll bore the hell out of you. And then uh, once we arrive, we're just going to go to a place that was set up one time for a for a parties. And what they had brought in was a uh, I think it was a jumble jet, part of the jumble jet fuselage. And they set it up as a club, but it went out of business. So now all you see is some of the airplane parts. Not nothing really special, I guess, as far as a airplane graveyard but it's a reason and a purpose uh, uh, to get on the boats if you've not been before then it's, it's worth worth a visit oh yeah. Right. yeah i mean what else do we have to do hey exactly. you're on holidays and i'm retired and i got special guests today yeah. justin hey, everyone, how you doing just living the thai life it's a hot one today chat very very hot but um i'm on my it's my third day here i've met with tim second time now and Tim's um, thankfully showing me around around Bangkok. And uh, I mean, I know I know quite a few places, but you know, there's always some of them. Oh yeah. I haven't been to. You know, lots of places I haven't been to as well. And so. yeah, thanks to Tim, yep. he's um, um, he's going to show me around, and I'm also going to vlog it as well. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> You can't have too many vlogs. No, of course not. Of course not. <laughs> Everyone's different too. We all edit differently. Oh, we all do. Yeah. yeah. It's all fun. Okay. So here we are. Here's the canal. Make sure we catch the right direction. Or is there two directions here? Let's just get on and get lost, mate. That's what I say. Yeah. <laughs> it's a fun bank book, yeah. Here we go. Oh, this one's going to get on the torch back. So we're okay. This is where you give the uh, person dressed in a sort of a life jacket, tell them where you want to go, and they'll give you a ticket. You have to hang on to that ticket though, as you will need that to do the exchange to change boats. So we'll be getting off at, a, at a, the piers uh, platinum, platinum or something like that. We didn't have to try and get on the boat, it was that far out. <laughs> yeah, that first step is very important. You gotta grab that rope. Okay, we made it. Now we gotta catch another boat line. Not sure where. This is gonna be confusing. Okay, here's the boat. No, we, we hope we get off at the right place. <laughs> and this is why they call it the Venice of Asia.
like an old dock used to be right over here on the right hand side. It's like pretty hazardous to leave those up. But who wants to pay to get them and take them down I guess. It looks like you're supposed to press the bell. There's a bell over There's a bell over here and you want to get off. Because if there's no passengers at that stop, they won't stop. Oh, taking a big turn. There's a guard dog. Yeah. Looks like a Muslim Muslim temple. This is the stop for the Mall Ban Kapi. So the uh, conduct conductor there let me know this is their stop. Also, it becomes very obvious it's the last one, and this is where they turn around. Then we arrived, and I can imagine. I'm going to check to see what the price of a taxi would have would have cost us. Uh, to get here. Well, so we arrived at, at the pier, which is located at this temple. It's the end of the line, and uh, the whole trip cost us uh, 19 baht. Uh, a taxi would have been at least 250 baht, and uh, so 19 baht each. That's a pretty good deal, and it, it's I don't know. It's more relaxing if you can ever use the Klongs or the river. It's uh, my uh, preferred way of travel. And now it's a seven-minute walk to the airplane graveyard, but we are going to try to find a, a place with AC where we can have a bite to eat and get rehydrated. And uh, this weekend, coming up weekend, we uh, pick up our car and we are going to try to take a road trip. It will be uh, the first of a new kind of vlog and we are really excited about uh, having the freedom to get out of Bangkok on the weekends. Uh, we got to the main road and found this place, Four, 24 hour Okay, market, the luxury market. Looks like a food court. Perfect. And a grocery store. And a restaurant. I'm betting there's not many foreigners around in this location. Well, looks like we're here. On the, the website, that I'll link. You can see how this looked when they had it as a party place.
but they're just squatters, from what I understand. Well, the article I read, the uh, the owners prevent vandalism, but some squatters uh, live here, and unfortunately, that's what we run across. And they don't want to do any negotiation whatsoever. They want to charge us 200 baht to go in here, look at a couple of junky old planes. And that is ridiculous. Try to do a little negotiation, but they, they won't do any negotiation at all. So, that's it. It's definitely not worth 200 baht admission each. But that's the way it is when you try to explore, right? Sure, yeah, Sometimes you get really big disappointments. So this place looks nothing like the party place it might have been at one time. So we're taking the boat back. The airplane thing took didn't work out. Okay, we have to switch boats here. It's like a, like a parking garage. Kind of cool. But I love it because it's underneath the shade of the trees. Okay, so we get off here and we switch. Ah. So then they got those heavy weights on this side of the boat, doesn't it? <laughs> Can you do it? Yes. <laughs> okay, so we just got on the second boat. Now we go to the pier that's for MBK. I think it's just maybe one stop, maybe two. Well, this is a video with a strange ending. So then we got on the back on the Kwong boats to come. And I don't know if we transferred at the wrong pier and then we got onto a different canal, I think. Something went wrong, yeah. right? <laughs> but we were, we were really lucky though when we got off that boat and we were quite far away. We, our option was to call a taxi. Um, this nice guy came up to us and uh, explained uh, what to do and how to get back. Very good. And, yeah, we were going to do the taxi, but he said that the traffic would have been too bad. So I, I, I don't think it's on the Kwong. Yeah, another 12 minutes. 12 yeah. minutes? So, and how much was it? It was cheap as chips. Yeah, it was... Uh, how much was it? Uh, nine baht. Nine, nine baht? Yeah, yeah, nine baht, that's right. Yeah, so now we're just going to walk uh, towards MBK, which is about five minutes away, and catch a BTS. The plan was to uh, uh, go to Jack's Bar, but somebody has a date he can't, he can't miss. Just one of them things. I mean, we, we were out longer than what we thought we was going to be on the plongs. Yeah. Um, but... Uh, you know, we've, we've still got a lot of time. I've still got two, two weeks left here, so oh, yeah. I'm sure we'll meet up, do more things. Yeah, I'll get you out there to Jack's Park, our little hole. I can't get anybody to go usually, so. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, well, thanks for watching, and I uh, hope uh, there's some interest in, uh, Cheers, in the boat tours. Thanks. I'll put uh, some links in the, dis in, the, in the description box that will help you if you wish to do, do something like this. Just don't go where we went. Peace.